crazy in this one, no Gymshark in this one. SPD is coming tomorrow, uh, which is awesome. And I still have all my Gymshark stuff over there, but you guys can't see it right now. This is just um, a new pair of shoes for the gym, and um, but it's bench shoes, like the FIUs, and then Animal Pack, um, like a joint supplement. Because recently my joints have been, honestly, like not, it's just been, they've been killing me, so. That's what we got here today. Yeah, the shoe. I mean, the shoes weren't supposed to even come in this early, but they came in this early, so that's good. They're supposed to come in next week. Okay, maybe even okay, the animal pack stuff is probably gonna come later then. So because I thought I was gonna, I thought it, sometimes they have Amazon packages that come in the same box or come in the same thing. But um, all right. Well, this is just my fuse. I ordered the animal pack stuff, so it should come in by. Like today, because I ordered overnight shipping for an extra like two dollars, so and it's on my computer. But anyway, let's open these fuse. You guys have never seen fuse. Um, in my opinion, they're probably the best bench shoe. Thank you, Sean Noriega. Oh, they're just like they're fucking nice as well. Like they're just like they have like a nice style. Oh, they have a nice style, I think. You know, like they're just they're just kind of clean. And for 30 bucks, you can't go wrong. Yeah, my, I've had my last videos for like over a year, and I was like, the, the bottom of them were just getting so worn out, so I was just gonna get a new pair. And here's the white pair, really clean, 30 bucks. Um, and yeah, pretty pretty nice on, I, I would have to say, pretty nice. So I'm gonna wear these to the gym today. Nice little, nice sole, and yeah. That's basically it. Um, today at the gym, we are doing a pause set of five on deadlifts, some back downs, and then for bench, it's a six by three. Um, and yeah, we have like everything like programmed weight, so it's basically like, very easy, nothing crazy hard. Um, and yeah, Saturday session is going to be a big one. Um, currently, right now, I'm on like not that many calories a day, which sucks because trying to lose some weight um, before I go to the competition. I'm pretty heavy right now. Um, check my weight. Pretty fucking heavy. One ninety one point six point eight. Like what the fuck? Um, it's like weight's really hard coming off for me. One ninety one point eight, and yesterday I was one ninety two at ten a.m. and now I'm one ninety one at like it's like one it's like one p.m. so that's not good. But it's it's been weird how I've been like try, literally tracking my calories. Um, maybe the food I'm eating. Um, I'm not eating like you know chicken and rice and beef and rice, which I might have to do. But I might literally have to go and just get some beef and rice right now because that's what I might have to do for the next fucking three weeks to get this weight off. Um, I think I'm just eating too high salty foods, like sodium foods, and just retaining so much water. Eventually the weight would come off, but it's just gonna come off longer than usual when I'm eating food like that. And then, let's say you ha you're eating food like that, and then one day you splurge and eat 4,000 calories, you're just gonna put that weight back on, which is fucking annoying. Um, so, I might go pick up like some shit to make beef and rice, because. When I was when I was back in the shit, beef and rice is my shit. That was like the shit I was just eating every single day, every single week, and just yeah, it's just so hard to cook it here. That's the only problem. And I don't have like a fucking pan or anything like that, which sucks. But I know how to cook it. I just have to go downstairs. I have to buy a pan, buy a little thing to get the rice to cook, and then put it in a little container. 
It's just so annoying, but I guess we might have to do it. So, well, today we really don't have anything to do. So today might be the day. It's a little, it's raining outside a little bit, but today might be the day we do that. Um, yeah, I think we actually might. I think we might do that right now. If you guys had to guess what is in this gym bag, what would you guess? Would you guess A, gym materials, B, a million dollars, or C, a dog? Um, well, if you guessed any of those, you're wrong because it's fucking groceries. Because I put my groceries in my gym bag. And how did that just fly off my face like that? But yeah, anyway, got a new gym bag. So I'm using this one as delivery of groceries. So I don't have to carry them. I just have it slanged over my chest. So we got the groceries. We got the goods. Let's go make this food. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is Friday, March. March what? Come on, tell me. That. March nineteenth. Uh, it's around like one thirty. Eh, one no, it's around one forty-five. Um, SBD package just arrived. Uh, gonna go walk down to the desk and go get it. Um, super excited for that. Super excited to open it. Obviously, gonna open up the curtains because it's a little dark in here. Get some light in here. I'm a little tired right now, but. We'll make it. We'll make it throughout today. Um, but yeah, we have this package open. Really excited. Uh, thank you, uh, SPD and Pete Spence for um, sending me this package. I really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. So we're gonna go get it right now and open it for you guys. We've got a few items in there. All right, guys. So we got SPD package here. Uh, gonna open it right now. Um, thank you again, Pete Spence. For sending me some gear, uh, really excited to open this. Love SBD, following it, following the company for around two years now. Right when I got the prof thing, um, heard about it. Heard about their knee sleeves, wrist wraps, and clothes, and also their belt. Probably that was probably the biggest thing. I just kept hearing SBD belt, SBD belt, and they made a top of the line quality belt. So we already have that, but we got some gear in here, some clothes, singlet, wrist wraps, knee sleeves, elbow sleeves. 
um, and like some socks and some shirts. So let's open it. All right, so first is the SPD knee sleeves. Um, I've had many pairs of this. Basically, uh, have it size an extra small. It's one of the OGs, so I haven't gotten one of these. It's one of the OGs, like just the red and blacks. But I'm not gonna like, try it on right now, but I'm gonna be wearing it at the gym tomorrow, so we'll be doing that. I got some wrist wraps, which I'm excited to open. I'm gonna open up these right now. Holy shit, these are fucking long. Um, I was in need of new wrist wraps, which is nice. And, you know, SVD definitely has the best kind. And that's, a, that's some wrist wraps right there. Those are some wrist wraps. So, yeah. But these are the regular black and red. Um, and, like, they're the, probably the long, I think they're the longest um, kind. And they're the stretchiest. So they're, like, the flex ones. Because for the stiff ones, like, I just can't. Those ones I don't really like. Um, definitely I like, this sh like the, the flex ones. It just makes my wrist more, I can move my wrist around a little bit more in the, in the, in the when I'm in a squat because I really need to like bend my wrist around in the squat, so definitely helps. This is the SBD brand t-shirt. Um, that's it. I think it's, it's basically, I mean, it's like, it's basically the same logo as the, the singlet that just came out. So we're just gonna put this on and then put out the singlet. Uh, then here we got the SVD singlet. Um, it's the power singlet. And this is a size large as well. This is what we're gonna be wearing tomorrow. Ooh, it's definitely tighter on the legs than the, the blue one. Oh wow. I'm actually like not used to that tightness on the singlet, but I think it actually would help in like the squat. All right, so we're gonna be trying this out tomorrow, but this is what it looks like. It's pretty sick, ain't gonna lie. Power singlet with the SBD. Same SBD logo underneath, pretty fire. Um, but yeah, it's it's like, it's interesting. Some some SBD singlets are like tighter than others and some are like looser. It's definitely weird, but this one's definitely on the tighter side um, and like large is like my normal size. My blue one is really, is looser. And then my other red one, same size, it's pretty tight. Um, but this is definitely the tightest. But yeah, you know, I think I can deal with it. Um, it's definitely nice though. Uh, you know, can't complain. You know, your legs are supposed to be, it's supposed to be tight around your legs so it's not, you know, moving around and it's not like a pair of shorts, so can't complain. Next we got the SBD Endure t-shirt, uh, green and the SBD Endure t-shirt black. So let's try those on. All right. See, so yeah, another basically fits the same as that one. Feels a little bit tighter actually, <laughs> but yeah. Um, yeah, it does, this one definitely feels a little bit looser. It's weird. I guess it really depends, but my, I have a medium shirt at home and it's like really tight, so that's why I got a large. And this one's pretty loose, this one's definitely tighter, my arms are definitely like hugging more, and it's definitely fitting better, so I liked, um, I like how I got large in this, but this is definitely, should have got a medium, unless it's going to shrink in the wash, but this one, Endure, the green, right, Endure green, very nice. Uh, I just, I love the color green, I love the, I love the color green, it just matches with some things, you know, just, you can match it pretty easily, so, very nice t-shirt, very comfortable, that's one thing, just, it's, both of these are extremely comfortable, so, that's all you need, you just need a nice looking t-shirt, and a comfortable t-shirt. I weigh 190 pounds, um, 5'9", and, yeah, I have, I have a pretty average build, I have, I don't have crazy long legs, and I don't have crazy long arms, I'm basically, as basically as average as you can get, I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, I don't have gorilla arms. I don't have gorilla like small legs where my legs are like fucking hobbit. Um, I have basically average on everything. So I would say the only thing I'm above average is my strength, and that just was because I'm just I don't know genetics, and I'm like probably the most average like male like length arm length. Everything's average. Nothing's like. Fucking, my arms are like six foot seven. I'm like, nah, I'm not. I, my height's not five foot five foot seven. My arms are six foot seven. All right, this one, fucking nice. I like how it's obviously like offset to the. You know, this is black and the logo's like the outside. The logo's green and this one's black and the outside logo. I'm sorry. 
This one's green and the outside of the logo is black. And this one's black and the outside of the logo is green. Um, and then it fills in with black. It just fills in with the opposite color. Extremely nice. Same thing. Fits fits like this one. Fits like this one. Um, but this is the this one is definitely a little bit looser. So I would say down I would say downsize and downsize and um, the shirt if you're getting it. I'm gonna try it on again, but it does feel a little bit looser. Elbow sleeves. Um, I'm definitely gonna be using these in the summer uh, when I'm not on knee prep and stuff like that. Right now, I don't really I'm not gonna be able to use them because um, I like prepping for like a comp and I'm not gonna be able to use these in USAPL. So I'm gonna use these like when I need them and like when I want to use them basically. Um, just like you know, slang around some weight or something. I never really use elbow sleeves, but I was like. You know, fuck it. Like, let's just get a pair of bubble sleeves. Um, just, just like, you know, tell SPD, hey man, I'll take a pair of bubble sleeves. Um, so yeah, we'll be using some bubble sleeves. Probably not now though, but eventually. So thank you for that for the bubble sleeves. And lastly, we got some socks. Another pair. Of, we got, yeah, we got some. Oh sweet, I got fucking Dello socks. I love getting Dello socks. It's probably the best feeling ever. Just like. So nice. Um, so here's some deadlift socks, size large. Uh, it's basically just the matches with the logo, SPD logo. I mean the, the new one, like the power one. That logo, pretty nice. Um, so that's deadlift socks. Then we got some sport socks. Some sport socks, same thing, logo, just not deadlift socks. They go up to you, you know. Mid calf, very nice. SPD, love it. And then obviously, your last socks are your ankle socks, your athletic socks. Show you guys these. I actually like ankle socks as well. You know, SPD logo on the back when you're in your shoes, and then just like nice and small, um, go up to your ankles. So, yeah, that's about it. Thank you so much for SPD. So, yeah. So that's about it. Thank you so much for SBD for sending me this package. I really appreciate all this gear. Um, I love the company. I've been following you guys for around two years now. So I've I've went through my I've went through a lot of SBD um, with shirts and you know belts. I have all that stuff, and it's lasted for around two years now. So that's awesome. Thank you guys for the new gear. I appreciate it. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to use most of this at uh, collegiates. Um, definitely gonna be using the socks. Um, the knee sleeves, definitely gonna use the new, the new knee sleeves, um, and then the new singlet, <clears throat> and then the new, the new singlet was gonna be awesome. So I really appreciate it. Thank you so much, SVD. But let's say you put them overnight on like a soda bottle, like this. Then I think it, uh, people got in, people definitely got in on this. Then it's just gonna stretch it out a little bit so it's ready for like you know training next day. Oh, I was just. So it's gonna stretch out and then basically like it just stretches out for a little bit and then it's just gonna stretch it just stretches back in and then it just fits your knee. Um, so yeah, you just stretch it out for a little bit. It's fine because first of all the tight knee sleeve in the beginning actually like, isn't helping you. Like it's basically um, like it's too tight to the point where it's not even helping you and I've experienced that. So obviously tight knee sleeves aren't the best aren't the best, but once you get to the right the perfect amount where it's it's like tight, but it's like fits around your knee perfectly. That's the best area. So that's what you kind of have to get it to. Um, and I don't fuck, I don't want to spend fucking three hours tomorrow getting on these knee sleeves. So I'm just gonna loosen. The, fuck, I'm just gonna loosen them up right now, um, so I could wear them tomorrow, basically. Alrighty, guys. It is Saturday, March twentieth, and we got SBD day today. Um, just made some rice. Gonna go downstairs and cook some beef and then put it together, make some beef and rice. Uh, yeah. But yeah, huge SBD day today. Um, gonna be filming for uh, my, my uh, friend at the gym, Corey. Thank you so much. He's gonna be filming an edit for me today for the whole Gymshark haul. Uh, I'm gonna be wearing a little bit of SBD just because 
I need a singlet to wear. Um, I'm going to be promoting Gymshark today mostly, but still going to be wearing SBD and, you know, such. So, yeah, that's going to be pretty cool. Um, I do have new SBD sleeves to try out today, which is going to be awesome, but going to be wearing Gymshark for a little bit of it, um, and then going to be wearing some SB SBD because SBD just has higher quality uh, knee sleeves. We're going to work on the Gymshark ones, help, help Gymshark make them better. Um, but, yeah. Let's go and cook this beef because we gotta go do that. Um, and I'll see you guys once I'm done with that because I gotta charge my camera a little bit. Good. 